All right, we are back here at Photoshop World 2015 at Photoshop Cafe with Colin Smith. Thank you for taking a couple of minutes to chat with me. Thanks for coming by. How has the show been so far? Oh, it's been great. Yep, yep. Good, good, good. It's a little bit of a lull here, so we kind of like jump in, get some interviews done while everyone's at classes, and then right. they're all going to come rushing back here right. pretty soon and be uh, buying some of the DVDs here. So, yep. um, tell me a little bit about this one. We, we were talking about this yesterday. You have this DJI Phantom um, quadcopter, and you said it's like the the go-to beginner's guide, right? Yeah. Um, so this one is essentially I did this one uh, launched it last year, and this one is covers the Phantoms, the One, the Phantom Two, Vision, Vision Plus, and essentially it's a nine-hour video. It's fully comprehensive. Nine hours. Yeah. Oh my God. And um, and it really it is for the person that just got a quadcopter and just pulled it out of the box. In fact, I even showed them how to pull it out of the box. <laughs> And Unboxing literally, I show you how to set it up. You know how to make do all the firmware updates and everything, so it doesn't fly away on you. You don't lose it and crash it. Okay. Um, and you know, talk about safety and all that kind of stuff, and just basically how to change the props and set up batteries, battery safety, because those batteries will explode if you don't take good care of them. Um, and then go out on the beach and some different locations and flying. Okay. And then get into more advanced flying. I'm showing how to do fully robotic flying. You know, autonomous using waypoints. Um, doing IOC, which is more advanced orientation. So it actually starts from the very beginning and then goes all the way through. All the way through. So yeah. you have nine hours. It's on a DVD, correct? Is yeah. it a download as well, or is it only yep. DVD? We've got a streaming uh, at academy.photoshopcafe.com. All that streaming stuff's there. Okay. And then on Photoshop Cafe, we have a downloadable version, or we have the, the, the DVD for here. the people that still people still love that sometimes. People love DVDs. They like something that they can hold. Like and, I own it. Know, it's not like yep. imaginary. Stick it on this shelf. Look yep. at it. You know. Yep. Uh, like candles to it <laughs> so cool so um, the interesting you thing you told me is it came out what a year and a half ago and you're doing a new version of it now too correct actually it's a little bit newer I did a couple of updates on here so this one we do you know for as far as the Phantom uh, 2 you know we have the new controller and all that stuff so it's fully updated for the Phantom 2 and awesome. then more than half of its post-processing as well you know Photoshop Live Room um, Premiere Pro GoPro Studio but what we're working on right now is the Phantom 3 and Inspire 1 versions. Awesome. So, you know, I've had these copters for a while now. In fact, I was number eight, I think, of people to receive the Phantom 3. Very cool. So I've been flying it like crazy, you know, uh, getting comfortable with it, learning all the ins and outs. Um, and we were just in Hawaii uh, just a week ago. Do wow. some shooting on that. I have to come in a second shoot with you. I'll like yeah. I'll carry your Phantom for you. Right, like. right, right. <laughs> so we we did some fun stuff. I mean, I flew up the Manoa Falls, 250 feet straight up. Awesome. Um, we're you know I mean we just amped it up a whole new level for the next video. So pretty excited. Now I heard you mention safety on there, and that's a big concern a lot of times. Um, have you seen now with the laws changing and stuff? Have you seen any pushback just um, from people? not wanting you to fly or giving you a hard time? You know, that's funny that you would ask that because, you know, there's a lot of talk about that kind of stuff. And honestly, you know, as weird as this sounds, I fly this, you know, for the last three years on an almost daily basis. I have not had one single person, single person. upset. You know, when we were in Hawaii, we were, you know, for example, we had, there were some guys doing boarding and stuff. You know, I asked people, for uh, permission. I don't just fly over people and buzz them. Yeah. You know, if I'm going to film someone, I, I talk to them first, right? So, Makes this guy's doing this windsurfing. And we saw him at the beach, hey, you know, do you mind if we do a little filming? We're making a video. Can we shoot you? And the guy's like, oh, yeah, absolutely. So, cool. please. And he's out there, and so we're filming him. Then another guy comes in, and I'm like, oh, boy, here we go. This guy's going to be upset, you know. Yeah. He comes up to me, he goes, oh, are you guys filming? And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we got, you know, mentioned the guy's name. We got his permission. We're yeah. flying around. And he goes, oh, that's great. He goes, um, you know, our group here have been trying to pull together these guys in Oahu to buy one of these so someone can go out nice. and fly and film over us. Um, you know, feel free anytime you want, just come out and, and play, you know, and very cool. Film. So, you know, there's certain things you do, right? Yeah. You're, it's it's you're with photography, though, too. If you right. pull the 7200 out and you're in someone's face, they're like, whoa, what are you right. doing? You respect are you selling this? Space. You yeah. know, so it's the same rules apply. Yeah. Um, it's the news, it seems like, that's blowing this stuff oh, up, it's making all hype. it. Yeah, all I hype. mean, the li one, one uh, headline I thought was awesome. Um, was the Washington Post responsible, you know, reporting, right? 
<laughs> Space Needle still standing after drone strike was the headline. <laughs> and then I actually looked at the story. There was some guy was flying, never even touched the Space Needle, was flying a Phantom. It's about two pounds. <laughs> Flew past it. Um, he was flying off a balcony at a hotel. The cops came by. They had a look, and then the cops determined, you know what? He didn't do anything wrong. They said, uh, you're not breaking any laws, carry on flying. So even when they printed the story, they still kept the headline, Yeah. you know, Space Needle still standing after drone strike. Well, like, I hope so. It was a two pound piece of plastic. They exactly. never even touched it. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> so yeah, but it is the news hyping stuff up as yeah. usual with everything right. and, and making it seem worse than it is, so. I am, but you know, what you but, think about it, what, what is it really about? It's, it's about selling advertising, right? So it's clickbait. They want people to click on their like site, watch their silly, you know, commercials so they can get through to the story, which is yep. sensationalized. And by then, it's too late. They already paid for the advertising. And they made the, they turned everything else into damages for people like us that maybe want to go out and have some fun and get yeah. great shots and everything. And so. unfortunately, that's a sad thing. And, you know, but there are idiots out there, right? Yeah. Like the, you know, the people oh. that were, you know, preventing oh, like, the, um, the fire service from oh, flying. Yeah. And you know, and, and that's irresponsible. And unfortunately, you know, like our community is a very close knit, tight knit community. Yes. And we self police. Yeah. And when people start posting hot dog stuff on the forums, you know, to get attention, you know, we're not like, oh, that's great. We're like, okay, that's irresponsible. Yeah. You yeah. know, so we don't. Um, well, they ruin it for everybody else. We don't make know. heroes out of people that yeah. are doing idiotic things. Exactly, it's very selfish. That they're like, you know, look at me, look what I did, and then no one else can do it. Like a lot of parts. A lot of people. Parts. Yeah, the guy that dr crashed into the uh, into yeah. the water yeah. there, the Grand Prismatic. It's like it's you shouldn't have been there first of all. Right. And on top of that, you crashed it. So now you make everyone else, you know, makes it harder for everyone else. Yeah, or the idiot bouncing off the buildings in New York. I mean. Yeah. It's very telling when you watch the video. It takes the guy three attempts to even take off. He's crashing. He can't even. The guy doesn't even have enough skill to take off. Yeah. So and, so, so you know, something like this yeah. may help educate people not only how to use it, but how to be safe, how to be responsible, yeah. how to from from again pulling it out of the box all the way through everything they yeah. did to, to be a pilot. Because again, that's what you kind of call it, right? Oh, yeah. Is piloting. Uh, absolutely. So. It is. Um, and in fact, you know, for commercial use, um, you know, there's, there's regulations and stuff coming sure. where you have. To to possibly get a type of pilot's license. For it. Some people commercially flying in Hollywood right now have airplane pilot's licenses pilot's license. to do it. So you're, you are flying um, an aircraft, an aircraft yep. and there's laws that you have to obey, yep. um, and there's safety, and then it's just common sense. And, and I go through that. I'm very, um, I repeat myself quite a bit on there about that, because I really want to drill it into people's yeah, heads. You, uh, it's like, you know, go out gotta, there, enjoy it. And you know, be responsible. And if you're responsible, no one's going to get hurt. Yeah. Um, it's, you're just going to have fun. Yeah. So, so here it is. It's the DJI Phantom Quadcopters DVD Aerial Photography and Video Handbook. Check it out. Where can they find it? Uh, PhotoshopCafe.com. There you go. So cool. Thank right. you very much. Cool. I appreciate. Right. it. We'll look forward nice to the to new you. version. All right. Good to Good see you as always. All right. You too. Thanks a lot.